It's a beautiful dish. And to think it's one of the most unseen and unheard of Vietnamese dishes in Australia, it just blows my mind. It's like a, a Vietnamese baba ganoush. Soft, silky, smoky eggplant flavoured with a fish sauce and anchovy salt concoction then intertwined with a fragrant spring onion oil. My grandma used to make this and to this day it still evokes a sense of nostalgia. Let's jump to it. Let's put the E's in Vietnamese. Grab three small eggplants, or one large one, and poke a few holes in it. This will ensure the eggplant won't explode in the air fryer as the steam and pressure builds up throughout the cooking process. Rub the eggplant with some oil just to start the cooking process, and then place it into a preheated air fryer at 190 degrees Celsius for 25 minutes, or until they're well roasted. In a bowl, add half a bunch of finely chopped spring onions, one clove of garlic that's been finely minced, and half a teaspoon of sugar, then mix well. Hot tip, adding sugar during this step is very important, it's critical, because the moisture from the spring onions will facilitate the sugar dissolving. When you add in the oil, it's great, but if you put it in after when the oil is already in, it won't dissolve. Add 30 ml of neutral cooking oil to a milk pan. I'm using grapeseed oil, but you can use peanut or canola too. Bring that to smoking point, then safely pour it into the bowl of spring onions. Oh, the aroma, it's instant. Set that aside while we wait for the eggplants. Let's have a look at that eggplant. That's perfect. And my hot tip is to not be afraid to overdo it. Overdoing the eggplant is okay because you're gonna still appreciate that soft velvety texture. The eggplants are too hot to peel at the moment. So what we're gonna do, we're gonna pop them into a bowl to cool down and cover them with a little bit of cling wrap. Yeah, 10 minutes. This is a neat little trick which will build up steam and allow the skin to come away from the eggplant a lot easier. Remove the eggplant skin, then roughly chop the flesh and place it straight into the spring onion oil. While the eggplant is still warm, season it with half a teaspoon of sugar, a tablespoon of good quality fish sauce, I like to use sun fish sauce, a pinch of anchovy salt and some chilli that are finely minced. Mix it well and allow all those flavours to get to know each other, then it's time to taste. It's like a, a Vietnamese baba ganoush. It's smoky, it tickles your tongue with savoury umami -ness. It's a beautiful dish. And to think it's one of the most unseen and unheard of Vietnamese dishes in Australia, it just blows my mind. I'm so thankful my grandma shared me this recipe. That's the beautiful thing about Vietnamese home cooking, is dishes like these, that just taste like a big warm fuzzy hug. I can eat this every single day. Try this one at home, go on. We all love a good hug. Do yourself a favour, for flavour. <laughs>